Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Tech Color Knowledge. Today I am going to explain you how to assign secondary IP in Azure portal. So this is my Azure portal, Azure dashboard you can see. So I am going to assign a uh, secondary IP with this VM, test 1000. Might be in your case you will not get the v uh, virtual uh, machine details in your home page. So what you have to do because sometimes it's not reflecting recent resource. Okay, so what you have to do, you have to go to the in a search bar, and then you have to type your virtual machine name, like your VM name. So in my case, like this. So once I'm typing here, you can see all the details like resource whichever is a tag with this name it's showing here okay so what you have to do you have to click on the virtual machine so I'm clicking here okay now you have to go to the networking section so this is network networking section networking option you can see settings networking you have to click on this now once you click on the networking then you will get the you know networking details the networking home page uh, like uh, networking page so here you can see all the details it will it will it will here all the details it will show so what i have to do i have to click on the network interface and then i have to click on ip configuration once you click the ip configuration you can see now this page is open and here one option is that is add plus sign you can see so what you have to do you have to click here in add button and then you have to give some name here as per your requirement you can give in my case just for ex for testing purpose I'm giving IP underscore test underscore IP now you can see here it's showing the private IP address settings so here is a two option one is a dynamic and one is a static in Suppose if you have, if you want to assign a static IP, if you reserve any IP and the, that IP wants to tag with the, like assign with the VM, then you have to click on the static and then you have to give the IP address here. Okay. If you go with the dynamic, like automatically assign the IP, then you have to click on the dynamic. And third option, you can see public IP address. So like if you have any associate and the associate, if you have any associate uh, like you know uh, IP uh, like group anything you can give assign here you can select and assign it okay and then you have to click on okay so once you click on okay then that secondary IP will be automatically it will be assigned okay so in my case I'm not going to click here okay because due to the subscription issue but this is the process once you assign this one, once you log into the server, you, you once you after logging to uh, login on the server, you just run the IP a command or if configuration, you will get the like uh, secondary IP details. Like uh, no need to add in any you know in uh, networking configuration file on the server side. Just uh, through like you know come to the uh, Azure portal and then you follow this step. So I hope uh, you like this video. So please subscribe, comment, share it. Thanks for your watching. Have a good day.